Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Samantha Rizundu. Today we have a haul. So these were, this is a random collection of different things uh, that I wanted to show you. So we've got Sephora, Priceline, Chemist Warehouse. Yes, and then I also got something in PR that I want to show you that I really want to talk about. So I might even start with that. So I, for the first time, did my nails yesterday with gel and my life has changed forever. Can I just show you my nail? They are super natural. So these are my nails that I've grown out and then I've got gel over the top of them. And I am so impressed. I am so bad at doing my nails. And my nails, they actually look professionally done. Like, don't you think? I'm pretty impressed with them. Um, so I thought I'd start with a nice nude. And this was actually sent to me from a brand called Madam Glam New York. And I, they sent me the kit with the LED light. I just want to throw out all my other nail polishes because I'm totally converted. I'm definitely going to buy more from them. What is in the kit is you get base coat and the top coat. The top coat is what solidified it all. And most importantly, before I show you the shades, they gave me a discount code for 30% off. 30%. I've never heard of 30% before. So I'm going to have the discount code left and the link um, down below in the description, at the top of the description. Check them out, the shades, I picked three colors and it was hard because there were so many colors and so many options. So I opted for this sheer nude and I'm so glad I did because like just for every day I'll go with everything. And this shade is called Dove. And I absolutely love this one. So these are soak off gel polishes. And even the top coat is a no wipe top coat. So it's like crazy easy. Like, so I got two others. I decided to go something a little bit fancy. I got the, um, it's not you, it's me, which is a, like a gold. I'll probably do this one next. I was tempted to do this one. And then I got hollow night, which is holographic, which I thought would be nice to put over. Oh, that is so pretty. I can't swatch it. That's, maybe I want to do that one next. That is so pretty. So it's kind of got this like neutral, that's the color there. It's kind of like neutral, but it's going to be holographic. So I got two glitters and a nude, but I think I want to get more because now, now I'm a gel nail girl, you know, I'm converted because me, hi, I have two kids under four. I cannot get to the nail salon salon nor do I want to spend money at the nail salon and I hate the crowds I'm in Sydney there's always a line it's always hectic it's not for me it's not my lifestyle I'm an at-home nail gal so this is very suitable for me and I can't rave enough I am so impressed and if you use the discount code 30% off I'm so impressed all right let's get into the stuff that I bought shall we start with Sephora. So I got the Han deodorant in Margarita Spirit. It's a nourishing prebiotic roll-on aluminium free deodorant. Right up my alley. I was like, Margarita? Oh, it smells so fresh and zesty. Um, yeah, it smells like lime. It's really nice. I'm excited to try that. I've almost finished my um, A Bit Hippie natural deodorant from Priceline. So this will be next. Then I bought this Happy Holidays set from benefit uh this was discounted to like 40 dollars, which is the price of one brow product it came with these cute little stickers that i'll give my daughter and then i got three brow products so i'm actually wearing it today i've got the shade 2.5 in precisely my brow it's perfect i got the gimme brow in two i'm not wearing this one i'm wearing the 24 hour brow setter which is also fantastic i love benefit brow products they are amazing and i got this cute little tin I might even give it to my daughter for pencils. Then this is what triggered the whole purchase. I got the Rare Beauty Highlighter, the new silky Positive Light Silky Touch Highlighter in Exhilarate. I'm wearing it today. I put too much on, so I tried to buff it out and make it look more natural because I've got natural makeup on. But you know, that's what happens with highlighters. So this is not the lightest shade. It's the second lightest shade. And I'm glad I got this one. It's really pretty. I thought maybe it's going to be too dark, but I think it's okay. 
Gosh, it's pretty because I prefer a warm tone highlighter over the icy ones. I hate icy ones um, because once you have bronzer and blush on, putting icy over the top, it, it's not nice. So I do like something warmer because it goes over the top of your warming up products, you know. So I really, really like this Exhilarate. It's just, it's quite beautiful. It's a really thin formula too. So that's it there. So that's my first ever Rare Beauty purchase and I'm very happy with it. I would like to try other things. What are your favorite Rare Beauty products, by the way? So I can check them out in the future. And then I got two rewards. I got the Clinique Moisture Surge. I have tried the moisturizer before and I really like it. Oh, it's even smaller than I thought. I thought it'd be a little bit bigger. But yes, this will definitely be a little travel moisturizer. I like getting these to travel with. And then I also got the Saturday Skin Waterfall Glacier Water Cream, which, water cream. Oh, that looks nice. Let's just try that. That looks like really thick and hydrating, but also light. Does that make sense? Oh yeah, it feels like water. No scent. Oh, cool. So I really wanted to try Saturday Skin. Um, Tara Babies raves about them. So I got that for 100 points. Got me some little baby moisturizers. Okay, and then I got one thing from Chemist Warehouse. I finally got it. My local had been out of stock for so long. So this is the Maybelline Perfecta 4-in-1 Glow. I got the shade Fair Light. It is my foundation today. I put a little bit of natural concealer on. I put the Nude Sticks concealer on, but it's like a light to medium coverage. So I've got very light base makeup today because I just wanted to wear this. I wanted to see what it's like, like the Charlotte Tilbury one you can wear alone. Very impressed, really, really liked it. Can't wait to keep using it. And then, I did a Priceline online order, which I don't usually do. I usually like to shop in store, but there was something that I really wanted and I could only basically get online. I've done a TikTok review on it. So um, this is the fragrance collection from All Saints and they are three 15 mil sized perfumes. Um, it's, just, it's new to Priceline. I will have it all linked, don't you worry. I got an exclusive sale. So I think it's originally $60. I got it for about $40 as like a, you know when Priceline does like new exclusive price because it's new, they're promoting it and give you a discount. So I got this for $40 and it has the one that I've been really wanting, which is Concrete Rain. So we have Sunset Riot. I've already smelt all of, all of these in a TikTok review. This was my favorite, Sunset Riot. It's very summery, kind of caramelly. Flora Mortis was kind of oriental to me, really beautiful, beautiful, like a florally oriental. And then Concrete Rain is the one that I really wanted to try, which is why I bought this, because I didn't want to buy the full size blind, but I thought $40 for three, and it's still 15 mil, like that's decent size. I was like, sold. Um, Concrete Rain is very light. It's very aquatic. Um, it almost smells like nothing, if I'm honest. A little too light, but I haven't worn it on my skin yet. So even the box is stunning. I love it. I love everything. I don't want to take it out of the box. I just want to keep it like this. So I'm um, very happy with this purchase. I think like no regrets because the other two perfumes are beautiful as well. And then I bought some Bondi Sands skincare because I've got the illuminating under eye, which I really like. And I bought the uh, liquid exfoliator. I haven't tried that yet, uh, but this is what I've been really wanting to try. The Melt Me Moisturizing Cleansing Balm with sea buckthorn oil and ceramides because I love cleansing balms, cleansing oils. It's a cleansing balm in a tube. It's quite interesting. The packaging is, it's too cute. It's too much for me to handle. I don't know what it's like. I don't know. I haven't read any reviews. And then I got the light and dreamy lightweight gel moisturizer with glycerin and watermelon extract. <gasps> Excuse me. Is this like the glow recipe one? I just opened the glow recipe one though. So I don't want to open this now. But now that I'm an oily skin gal, you're probably sick of hearing it. My skin type has changed. I'm now oily. I need to try more gel, lightweight moisturizers. I used to be into like the thick, the thicker the better, because I used to have dry skin. But now I've, I can't handle the thickness. It's too much. Um, and I'm getting to try all these new 
but like I said, I would have never battened that eyelid at before. So I will definitely, oh, day and night. That's cute. See, day, day and night. Um, so I'm really excited to try all those things, but I don't open too much skincare at once because it does go off. So I, it's not, I won't, might not necessarily be trying those straight away. Um, I'm not far off needing to open the cleanser though because I'm using the one size spray. I've been using it for a while and it hasn't ended yet. So we're getting there, we're getting there. Well, that's it guys. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.